I'm Philippe Presti, I'm the sailing coach of the Michael Team USA. I feel myself like a sailor, which is not on the boat. And I try to have this sort of attitude. I'm off, off the boat, I've got less pressure, and, and I try to be the sailor. Same attitude, same feeling, but uh, with more perspective, and I, I try to give them that. Yeah, well, he's really our eyes off the boat in terms of the, he's filming, but he's also you know, giving us feedback in between whether it's a practice race, whether it's a straight line lineup, telling us what he's seeing. It's very difficult on the boat to get that picture. When we're on the water, I'm, I'm on a chase boat close to the boat. I'm uh, connected to the boat with, uh, with the audio, um, try to be really in connection. I'm filming the boat and every time the guys stop alongside and try to understand what's the feeling, what are their plan and, and try to help them. If I saw something, I can give them feedback. These guys are extremely competitive. They're just pushing hard every day, all the time. They're young and strong. I try to, to have the same attitude on my coaching and uh, the way I approach the campaign. For me, that's the beauty of sport. If you just practice it by yourself, you will have your limit and eventually you will challenge your limit uh, a little bit. But when you face adversity, and the best adversity is uh, opposition, they will push you harder. You know, you'll be on the corner and you, and you have to react. You know, nothing better than competition in that perspective. Well, in today's world, you have too much data, to be honest. You know, we have multiple cameras all throughout the boat. Some days I've got something like uh, 700 giga of data to load in half an hour to, to present my debriefs. That's a big balance for him, is getting that all into an editor format where it's very, very efficient, but we can make a decision that afternoon and then the next day, well, hopefully we've taken a step forward. I think he's so good is because of the way he comes across. It's definitely, a, I'd say, a non-threatening way. It's a way that uh, guys will sit down and listen to him. My role is to um, ask questions, not answering any question. If I answer a question, something goes wrong. Make sure everyone is involved in the discussion and make sure everyone try to solve the problem. It's like uh, breaking the code, you know? You're, these guys inventing the new way of selling. You know, last year we could foil jive and today we Tech and then you know they're, they're creating what, what's going to be the future of sailing. You look at the manoeuvre and, and, uh, and you say yeah we want to improve, you know, we want to find the meter that will make a difference at the end so we look at all the angle uh, of camera, you can look at the, the rudder, you know sometimes the rudder popping uh, uh, out to, you know you're flying too high and the rudder popping and, and generate an instability around the boat but you can also look at the hard rate of the of the grinders to, to figure out how hard it is to do that maneuver. The goal is just to, to find that meter, you know, it could be technical, it could be management as well, you know. But we find a solution, next day we got, we're going to try it again and, and we try to evaluate the, this uh, new solution and, and the next day we, we come back and, and we, we try to nail that and then we try to find another meter. <laughs> this game is so interesting because it's unpredictable, you know, someone will come with a another solution, better or worse. It's extremely exciting and has great motivation. Every day you will discover something new. That's really my motivation. The, these boats got definitely something different. The speed they can produce, and this is very you know, stimulating. It's very exciting because you have to face all the problems that you never even imagined. All of a sudden we're taking off. You know, there's another dimension, and, and uh, I wonder if we're going to end it up. So. <laughs> Maybe next cup. <laughs>